Hello everybody, the Wonder, Wonder Panda here, and welcome back to another episode of my Let's Play 4, Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Last time we didn't get a whole lot done, we tried getting more collectibles for this one quest that's taking a while to complete, and uh, we are back here at Colony 4 because there are more people to talk to. So, let's talk to uh, Maxi. The secret to Ethel's strength is in her talent arc. Her attack power goes up every time she uses it. Read the, fall, the flow of battle well, as she, and she's virtually in, on par parallel, parallel as an attacker. That said, she might end up inadvertently drawing enemies' attention in the process. Defenders have to be equally vigilant. Okay, so now we have over here. The monsters are now even re reaching Baron Knoll, apparently. And one of our guys got attacked recently too, right? We gotta do something and fast. And we got ha hurting monsters. And now we know things. We just keep getting more and more quests, don't we? So let's go talk to Mir. And one, you'll note that the annihilation effect has caused a certain warping of the landscape around here. We, can, we can't predict when the phenomenon will occur. The black fog sometimes presages it. Best to stay away from it. Alright, now we have Flareon. If you're going to, get to the Cadencia region, where the Great Sword is, then I advise you to go directly through the Valley. Beware, if you take a right turn, you'll find yourself in Colony Iota's domain. Okay. So, is that it? Oh, wait, there's another. More information here. Sure you've heard the re Recon Report. Right, the one about the. Right, right by Steam Breeze Funnel, right? That's slap bang in the middle of monster territory. I pity those poor. I can read it all. Unsent husks. Got it all memorized. Okay, I guess, like. Yeah, this is a completely different uh, colony from when I wanted to. where I wanted to go to, but at least there's still more people to talk to, so. Let's talk to Brunella. Ruby Fox is fast. If you're making your way to Sword March, then you should make a use of uh, LC's spout as a landmark. LC spot, you say? Okay, got, I got it. Uh, 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 something else. You'd be well advised to steer clear of Dinar Desert. It's a very dangerous place. Desert, huh? Well, I don't think I'd want to go there anyway. Dangerous or not. Okay, now we have Laszlo here. Kukucha is a bit of a, bit of a slowpoke at, at times, but her cooking ability is first rate among all keys. Silver rank QZ, I'd say. Yeah, the little knob on's onto something. The, mo most, the most paltry, nasty ingredients are... Transformed into incredible dishes. If it wasn't for manning the hit kitchen, we'd be passing the days each no eating nothing but bland rations. Oh, Trash! How they're doing. Okay, so is that it? I guess we can go over here and discuss the topics. I'm getting peckish. Do you have any snacks? So let's talk to Unsent. Let's yeah, talk about Unsent Husks. Hmm. Something bar bothering you, you know. Your, bo your brow is awfully furrowed. Uh oh, sorry, I didn't realize I was making a face. Is there something on your mind? Yeah, it's nothing too important, though. Oh, really? Sure you're not remembering the thing about the husks? Oh, yeah, that has to be it. Uh, I'm, am I really that easy to read? We've known each other for so long. Of course, we can read your mind by now. You're t talking about the husks that were left near, left near that Sing Breeze Funnel place. It will be dangerous to send them off. They're right inside monster territory. Is it really bothering you that much? To be honest, I don't think I can let it go. At the same time, though, it feels wrong to put everyone in danger just because I'm feeling uneasy. Only back like that isn't he like you. We'd rather just you just ask us, straight up. And anyway, not like anyone here would object to sending off the husks. Of course not. I've been in favor of it from the start. Right, but we have to give them a proper send-off. Noah, Mio, you're, all, you're the, you're the, you're the off-series here. You should make the judge, judgment call. I'm sorry, everyone. I, I know. Sc scratch that. Thank you for going along with me on this. And we got another quest! Melody of Morning! And now we have this one. Hurting Monsters! Shall we put our heads together on this? So, just as we finished off solving the resources problem, a pack of monsters shows up. They said they'd deal with it, but we should help, right? And how long are we supposed to hold their hands? Have you forgotten what we're actually mean meant to be doing? What? Well, no, of course not. Colony 4 problems are, are for Colony 4 to solve. Ethel said as much. And we're outsiders. The more we meddle, the more they'll be on guard against us. Do you think that, that we what we've been doing is just meddling? 
readily not meddling. Who cares as long as we're helping? The actions you believe to be correct don't always lead to good out outcomes. I think I remember Ethel saying that. Yes, but think about it. Doesn't it mean that you don't, if you don't take the action in the first place, you can't know if it's good or bad? Oh. Neo, you're... She's right, is what she is. S sitting here wringing our hands and won't do anything. Calmly forgetting are going to be at the Baron Null, right? That ain't fair. At least, we can at least, you know, look out in on them. Make sure you're, they're handle handling themselves. I agree with you, Nii, Tyon. No objections. It's your logical conclusion following what I originally said. Good. We'll do any everything we will. We'll do something anyway. We got charity and hi hi hypocrisy. Now all we have left is changes. Everyone, a moment of your time. Looks looks like wrecking the flame clock isn't enough to make it, everyone be like us. Yeah, they don't have to worry about the clock, but it's everything apart from that stays the same. Guess it's just us that can interlink change change blades and so on. Bit of a shame though, isn't it? The trick with the using other blades is pretty smart and useful. Lance, have you got comfortable with using Santa's blade yet? Yeah, more or less. I'll tell you this though, bashing enemies around with that thing is a real bloody kick. Oh hey, there's a, here's a thought. Why don't we all try using Santa's blade at once? Offense is the best def defense, right? We'd be done in no time. Done and dusted as husks on the ground, yes. What do you mean? Attackers like Santa can only focus on the offense when they get, got a defender to cover them. You have to maintain good balance and team comp composition. Going all in on any one role would only risk to total defeat. But yeah, no, I'm sorry. You're right. It's exactly as you say. Here's here's what we do then. Tyon, you do the defender thing. And everyone else grabs Senna's blade. Better, yeah? Were, were you even listening to me? Or does the word balance have too many syllables for you? I guess that wasn't a quest. Okay. Let's bounce. So is that it? Is that all new that we can find here? I guess so. So I'm gonna go to map and uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to ace the region and wait, uh. Huh? Heck. Uh. All oh, right, over here. Colony thirty. So I want to skip, tra skip travel to here just so I can see. If there's anything I can progress that one quest. So actually, I'm gonna go to quest here and then. Uh, I'm gonna, uh, okay. Now let us go over here and... Um, which one okay, I guess I can do this again. So, I need to find, actually, Stinger Piles. I need four more Stinger Piles so we can actually complete this quest. Maybe now, like if we find more Stinger Piles around here. So hopefully a few of these uh, collectibles will have those. Those don't look like it. Okay, there's one! Three more! Oh, did, forgot to jump. No, that's not it. Okay. 
You got another scene, probably need two more. Okay, well, uh, I'm hoping one of these will have another one. Like, no, I don't think so. Ah, uh, come on! Tripping joy, that's not what I want! Seriously? That we could still find them this far. Like these stinger piles this far down here. Do I think this is one. No. Yeah, here's one. I need one more. One more now. Joint. Not gonna go near you guys because you gotta grow. a couple minutes. Okay, we got it. We got the singer pile. Okay. Now I'm gonna go back. And... Fast travel back here. Because now I think we can finish this quest. Um, which one was it again? And there we go! Oh, please, phase two completed. Thanks, everyone. F phase two. Met so far, Repepa only cobble together parts on hand. Finally, can build all important sections. And phase three start. It's finished in no time if we work on this. Oh great, there's more. Just wondering how much further is there still still to go? It finished at phase ten. You won, mate! We say we help, we see through to the end. Sounds like someone's starting to started enjoying himself. Doesn't it? Oh ho! Keep collecting material and bring to Rupapa. Doric's going to be the protector we've always needed. Our mighty guardian. Yeah, I can't wait for it to be done. Just watch me go. Oh, great. Well, at least we completed this one. We meant to push straight through all the way to phase 10. Uh. We can take it slow. There's a ton of scrap out there for us to collect. Yeah, my, my good friend really put shiny metal back into it. That's chief for Papa Mama's example. Cannot, cannot afford state le stay left in, of left in dust. North currently proceeding on track of phase phase three. Friends bring materials and Repapa get give them a speedy quick check. Is this what you wanted? Yeah. This is gonna take a while. So hang on. Okay, so I guess we can't find like some of these stuff are in like regions that we haven't discovered yet so we're not going to be able to do any of that yet but uh I, I guess we can talk to this mecha friend here taking care of a papa now won't you mega friend I, I i see you're just raring to go well no i'll do my bit on the parts gathering front too okay 
Okay. So now, oh wait. I see someone over here. Zuzo. So the commander and those not on are teaming up to build a large, larger scale Levness. It's good for you, Zed, though. Gives him some space to focus on his work again. I know it's a lot to ask, but look out for the commander, won't you? I'm wondering if there's some more people over here to talk to. I'm just gonna check. Oh, there is a Yuzette here. If Valdi and Nopan are busy with Dork, it's easier for, my for me to concentrate on other tasks. There's still a mountain of things to be that need doing. Yeah, well, take care of yourself, mate. Then don't work yourself sick. Okay, I think that's it, so... I'm gonna go to the quests here. And, uh... Wait. Did we complete that yet? Let's go over here. Uh, guess not. I guess that does that quest doesn't have a quest marker, so I'm gonna go over here to Melody of Morning. Fast travel to Minnow Arch. And, uh, we're gonna head this way. That sound. Supply drop! Looks like we might get lucky. Drop down. <sighs> and here's a ether Let's channel. Some ether. I think our objective is over that way. Where did we end up now? We discovered Sing Breeze Funnel. Uh. Oh boy. Uh, at least I don't think that these guys aggro us. Oh no. I hope I don't get to fight the, have to fight those enemies. Hornets region, a lace highway. these and uh, take yeah. care of these husks With that, I think our job is done. What say you, Noah? But yes, I think so too. Thank you for all, all, all for helping me with this. That should bring a little peace to, to those who fell part way. Yeah, I really hope it does.
And quest complete. Great guys. Okay, so now that we uh, finished that quest, we can go over to uh, this one, Charity and Hup Hypocrisy. And I believe... Yeah, it's over here, so we need to script travel to the Wall of the Great Hand. And now we need to head this way. side maybe at least it's just showing us where to go so yeah it's over here right, here we are hey look let's pitch in Conversation can wait. We'll take it from here. We've made some new friends. All right, so we're taking out these hard hoxes. Like, they're level 18, so this is going down very fast. Oh, great, there's a lot more. Like, 10 more that we need to fight. Bring them on! I'm gonna grab these real quick. And, uh, I don't want to chain attack this. Uh, these enemies are really low level, but I, I'll save that for harder fights. Well, at least the snow went out went down went through pretty quick. How is everyone? No injuries? Why did you help us? Do we need a reason? Well, Agnes helping out Keeves is uh, unheard of, isn't it? Your point? You not get it yet? We do not trust you. In your Tim. Oh, you again? You just don't die, do you? We heard you were in close with Commander, but that doesn't mean anyone else in Con Colony 4 trusts you. I'm not trying to win your trust, just, you just needed help. What did you say? I don't care about obligations, I just want, don't want to turn my back on anyone who fights for others. That's why we stepped in, no more reason than that. So you act in accordance with your principles, is that, that's it? Ha, that's the best lion agnes lover, lover like you can come up with. Sorry we over sorry we overstepped our bounds. We'll go. Like, okay, fine, I approve of Ethel's judgment. Huh? I apologize for what I said before. I was just trying to test you. Come on, Maxie, what are you saying? Commander trusted you from the start. We have a duty to abide by her wishes. 
We heard about the thing with the medical supplies. That was all you. Anyway, we may as well introduce ourselves though. I'm Maxi, tactician, squad leader. Good lad, Maxi. Or what? So, what kind of tests were you were you talking about earlier? We wanted to use this opportunity opportunity to make sure of something. Whether we could trust our mission to to well, for what? Captain, you mean your your strategy was aimed at them? I was pretty sure you'd pass. Wait, are you serious right now? Them? Jeremy, I'm not saying this makes up for the past, but we can't forget that we're fighting for the living. Tch. We're in a critical situation. We need to break it out of it while we can, and we've got just a plan to do it. I want you help your help to make it happen. Are you sure about this? I'll be frank, we don't have the firepower. We're busy showing up colony defense, so I'm taking us out so many as will help us. But more than that, I thought that proving your sincerity to everyone would be inspiring. See. There's some days yet before the operating begins, so just think it over. Right. He's not happy about it, though. At least we completed uh, this quest. Oh, so that's how they're doing. And, uh... I'm wondering when that will be, like, another quest, like, later down the line that we'll be able to continue. So, let us go for... Uh, I guess all of these are complete. So I guess we can we can just uh, continue on where the heart is. And oh wait, I forgot to go back to map. And uh, I think we need to go to next region. And uh, yeah, over here. Uh, wait, what? I guess we can only tra 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 skip travel here. Okay, so I guess, uh, let's start going this way. I think that we have to walk a bit. At least it's, like, not very far off like where we have to get to. All the way across. And we discovered Colony 9 Barracks. Uh, Colony 9 Canteen. Here. I'm impressed. You didn't run away this time. Uh. I'll explain what comes next. The rest of you are dismissed. Stay cool, Kite. I'm always cool. Tell us about Agnes's movements. Right now. They're assembling their forces on Everblight Plain. They've stopped concealing themselves, which feels like cause for concern enough. They're confident they have the numbers for a full assault, then. Or perhaps it's a feint. Or they're just a bunch of dolts who like pretending they have a plan. <laughs> I'm not in the mood for jokes right now. Hey, we need a little levity sometimes. With enough food, we can draw this out. Give the word and we can even launch a raid. I told you, that's not going to happen. It would cost us too many lives. 
What then? Our troops are hungry, anxious, and quite frankly, more pissed off by the hour. You leave things like this, and we're going to fall apart by ourselves. We could just remove their reason for fighting you. What? In plain language, please. If we smashed your flame clock, it would alter the equation. If you smashed it? Uh, what? Well, now I know you're all jokers. Kite, biggest joker of all. This is why Kite always runner up in life. No one can take serious with hopeless second best attitude. Shut it, Riku. You, you really know how to hit a man when he's down, don't you? Why are you back here anyhow? How'd you worm your way back into Zeon's favor? Meh. No worming performed. We don't need you here. I've had enough of seeing my friends die. Betray me. I can't deal with this dirt anymore. We feel just the same. Which is why we want to do as much as we possibly can to help. That's why we came back. Yeah. You're not fooling anybody. You need not believe them. But they will prove to be an asset. Huh. So that's it. You're siding with them in the end. You choose Noah over your own lieutenant. Again! That's not what I'm saying. Don't you realize how hard I'm trying here? Ugh! Spark this! Sorry. I didn't mean to complicate matters. On the contrary. Was this not your intent? I would have thought you'd be gloating by now. We can gloat if it makes you feel better. But you can't just judge someone in the heat of the moment. Whatever you might think, suspicion will be cast upon you. That is all I can say. Suspicious or not, isn't it about time you tell us this plan of yours? You said we'd prove to be an asset. I'll continue. Though we have a geographical advantage, our provisions and numbers are limited. That's what the enemy will be banking on. And that's where you come in, as the Vanguard. Our sudden appearance will put a spanner in their works, and that will give you the edge you need, right? Seeing Keves and Agnes Bods fighting together and tearing up their front line is going to throw them off their game for sure. So we've got to fight independently then. Better than being on a leash, I suppose. You seem to misunderstand. I'm not cutting you loose. You are still being regarded as traitors. Keep in mind that I shall be supervising your every action personally. Sir, yes sir, Commander, sir. Do you have to? Let it go, guys. I'll send details of the operation to your Iris. The plan will commence at once. We're on it. Okay, so that's gonna do it for this part, guys. So, if you like this part, be sure to subscribe to my channel, leave a like and post a comment about what you thought of the video, and I will see you guys next time for more of my Let's Play 4, Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Have a wonderful day, guys, and peace out!